Hey guys, uh, back again with more podcasting tips in Logic Pro. Um, I've had a few people ask about turning their video uh, video blogs or webinars into podcast episodes, um, or maybe being able to import a video here and clean up the audio a little bit just for a better sounding uh, production. Um, it seems a little confusing at first, but it's actually fairly simple, uh, as long as you don't have to do any major editing or syncing to video, which unless you're working on movies and stuff, you really don't have to worry about. So um, I'm just going to show you how to import that and clean up the audio and then export. So uh, find your video file, wherever that might be. Um, so let's say I just want to clean up the audio for this video here, Untitled. So just drag this into Logic. I always start at bar one, just because. And now you have the option. So if you're taking audio out of a video that you want to use as a podcast episode only, um, you can uncheck open the movie and that will just pop the audio track in here. Uh, if you want to keep the video on, just keep that checked, open the movie, click OK. Um, you always want to follow, if you see the sample rate or the frame rate, you always want to follow what's coming from the movie. So whenever it has a suggestion, just say use 48 here and use 30. You always want to keep uh, the settings matched to the video. That way it does not fall out of sync or anything. All right, so you have the video track up top, the audio track here. And when you first import this, you'll be unable to move things around. It locks things in place. That way it doesn't fall out of sync with the video, which is helpful. You shouldn't need to move things around, but in case you do, um, right click on the audio track here. And you want to go to uh, Simpty Lock, and you can click Unlock Simpty Position here, and that will let you move this thing around, change tracks. If you need to, like I said, you probably shouldn't have to worry about that. So once that is set, uh, do any post-production you want, any mixing you want to do. Uh, I'm not going to cover that in this video. Set your locators around the entire portion of the audio video, and to export, Go to File, go to Movie, and it's not called, uh, yes, Export Audio to Movie, which sounds a little confusing, but this is exactly what you want. It's going to create the new movie, um, and then you can just name it something totally different. Uh, hit OK. And now here it's going to ask you, this is confusing too, it's asking you if you want to keep the original audio that was on the movie, not the audio that's coming from Logic. So if you leave this checked, you're going to have... The audio is going to be doubled up. It's going to have your new mixed audio as well as the original stuff from the movie, which is not what you want. So uncheck this and hit OK, and it will do its thing, and you're ready to go.